so I experienced very harsh conditions because of the heat. In the summer months, I experienced things like um, loss of appetite, uh, dizziness, an inability to sleep at night. I um, was forced to take measures into my own hands trying to pour, uh, cool, cool off my body temperature. Things like wearing wet clothes, uh, even flushing the toilet several times so the water gets cold and splashing toilet water on my body. Very dangerous. People are getting sick and even dying because of the dangerous temperatures. The last summer that I was incarcerated, which was 2020, uh, 2020 that summer, uh, there was a thermometer in our dorm that was pretty high up. It had a piece of electrical tape over that thermometer so we couldn't read the reading. The maintenance crew would come in with their ladder and look at it. Uh, we decided we wanted to know how hot it was. When I peeled back that electrical tape, the reading on that thermometer was 136 degrees Fahrenheit in the dorm where I was living with 101 other women. I was panicked. It, it frightened me. Um, it also made me feel a little bit justified in knowing how I was feeling, that I wasn't crazy, that it, it was that hot. They would cut themselves or overdose on medication. Uh, and have their bunkie tell the officer or staff so that they could get taken to the crisis management center, which is air conditioned. To, they wanted relief from the heat and they were desperate for it. With the climate changes, we are going to see even more heat related illnesses and deaths. It's, it's a very scary future.